power is one of those illusory beasts. I've given so much of my own power away by trying to find my power in external things. In relationships, a house, success, control, having the slyest remark, the gossip, being the victim, needing to be right, judging others, the list goes on. Or I gave my power away to systems and institutions that claimed to take care of me, but they were really just feeding off of me, not realizing I already had my power. I thought all of these things, these achievements, these beliefs, these societal systems were here to save me. I wanted something else to create my power for me, to get rid of my fear. But that fear always came back. I wanted something to save me from the fear of truly seeing my own power. Because I knew once I saw it, that meant I would have to step into it. I'd have to change. I'd risk becoming the outcast by accepting the power of who I actually am. It's so much easier to play the victim with myself and to keep desperately asking, what do I do? When will I feel secure? And how do I get what I want? And the world kept feeding me false solutions. And those solutions would be those beasts of illusion. Beasts that feed off of me and always leave me exhausted, scared, and unfulfilled. It felt like I had no way out until I was so ragged, it started to click. The only thing that's going to save me is myself. That my power and my comfort have been inside of me the whole time. That the hero I've been waiting for is me. I realized that these beasts gave me nothing but empty, archaic promises all strung together by fleeting moments of relief. They were draining me of my life force. I realized that a lot of the institutions and systems and beliefs in our world are just vampires. Their rules and behaviors kept me small, kept me in fear, made me second guess myself so that I would keep giving my power away to them. I was their food source. They were surviving off of me. And once I saw it, I couldn't unsee it. And my whole world started to change, began to shift to support the power inside of me. I was no longer chasing an illusion. Instead, I saw the reality. And that, well, that became my superpower.